Naruto. Yo, so morning, day is Sunday. No. Yeah, I just want to weigh in on the uh, takeoff, takeoff of the big girl situation. It's very unfortunate. My brother takeoff was killed, man. But uh, I just uh, look at it. Man. Take a, you know, look at the situation and like what we can learn from this situation. That's why when you get to a certain level, you gotta elevate certain energies. You just don't need to be around, man. You just don't need to be around certain energies, man. Man, that's unfortunate for the brother takeoff, man. And what we do know is that he was not the intended target, man. So, shoot, I just use this as a learning lesson with this, you know, you gotta look at it as a lesson because, you know, you gotta look at it as why you hang around some people. Yeah, it was a very unfortunate situation, man. I'm always looking at things as like, why are we hanging around certain people? Where are we hanging out? And, you know, what's the purpose? You know what I'm saying? Like, certain energies, you, you know, you shouldn't be around, man. You get to a certain level, you know what I'm saying? You got to elevate, you know. These Migos were, were probably 30, 40 million a piece. Why would they hang around in a place like that? So, you can look at it in, in your life, you know what I'm saying? Because I made changes years ago. I used to, I used to hang out a lot. <laughs> and very, you know. You know, tough environments, you feel me? I used to do that back, in, you know, a while back, years ago. You know what I'm saying? But I changed certain places I go, who I'm around, and why I'm there. You know, that's what you got to look at. You know, why are we hanging out here? Who I'm with? Because <laughs> if you look at this, you could just be somebody in the background. Take this as a lesson. The bullet don't have to be for you. You could be you could be a brother or a sister in the background, you know, and get hit with the shrapnel from somebody else's situation. So always be mindful of you know of uh, be mindful of where you're going, who you with, and why you there. Because most times when you you know when you at a club, most times you just standing around. It's just most times people not even dancing. You go to the club, nobody's really dancing or doing nothing. You know what I'm saying? So just look at it like, why am I hanging with these certain people? Why? Why? I'm way up here. Even even you, as a as a post employee or whatever you do, you look at it like, why, why am I here with these people? You know what I'm saying? And a lot of times it's, it's jealousy. You know what I'm saying? The, the ladies, they not checking for this person, so they trying to, you know, trying to, you know, antagonize these guys because the ladies might like them, you know, that's... That's, that's how it goes sometimes, man. I think it was a situation of that. You know what I'm saying? Because it was, uh, I think a small, a private event with like 40 people. You know what I'm saying? And these guys, you know, they were their guests. So that's, you know what I'm saying? The Migos are like pop I, pop stars, man. Worldwide stars. I have no clue why they were there. You know what I'm saying? It makes no sense. Me, I wouldn't be there. They security should have been tight. These guys are worth a collective over a, a hundred million. All three together got to be worth over a hundred million, man. That and the guys they arguing with is not on a level. So you take that back with your life. Like, why am I around these energies, man? I got stuff I gotta do. I got goals I'm trying to hit. These people just want to hang out all the time, you know. Just hang out, turn up. That's all they want to do. So you gotta look at it like, why am I? Hang on with these people, you know what I'm saying? Why am I around this environment, man? Because like I say, what we can take from this is you don't have to be the one in the incident. I've seen it plenty of times, man. I done been at, I done been in clubs that got shot up. I done been in areas by the grace of God, or you know what I'm saying? I done got up out of there before things got crazy. You know, that's, <laughs> that's another good reason to be an athlete. You know, I was an athlete. You know, football player, running back. But um, anyway, yeah, man, just be mindful of your environment. Why are you all this idle hanging out? 
Man, you gotta think about all that. When you got stuff to lose, you around people that don't got nothing to lose. These Migos around people have nothing to lose. They were around people that have nothing to lose. They thought they were safe, they thought they was good. These cats is wolves, man, they were wolves. You know, young, dumb, trigger happy guys. That don't mix. You you meet, you, uh, the Migos, I've seen it. They normally have their security tight, but they were comfortable with the uh, Prince family or whatever, so. I'm blaming the Prince family 100%. I'm sorry. It's on you. These are your these are your guests. You know what I'm saying? So you have these are pop icons pretty much. The Migos, man, that's crazy. You know what I'm saying? So I take this back. It's a learning lesson for me. And I hey, I, I've been you know, I've been through this kind of stuff, man. No, I'm not going up. You can't just look at it. Don't jump on every Somebody invites you out. You don't have to accept everything somebody asks you to do. Learn to say no. <laughs> Learn to say no, man, because if, if you got that intuition, then you're like, uh, I don't know. I don't think I want to go there. Might be a little rowdy. A lot of young cats. You know these cats. These days, trigger happy. They like to show out for the, for the females, show out for their fellas. So, man... You know, you gotta really be mindful in the day, especially you living in the inner city, any major city in the United States. So you gotta be, you gotta be, uh, you gotta be mindful of the environment you're going in. So I'm always looking at, uh, I'm looking at, I'm looking at the logistical stuff. You know, where are the cameras? Who's gonna be here? Why am I here? Who am I with? You know, you gotta really think about that, man. Your life is valuable. Take off life was valuable. And they shot him dead like a dog in the street, bro. That's sad, man. That young man worth money is not everything, but he was worth 30, 40 million hanging around. Got <laughs> that should never happen, man. That, that was unfortunate, man. So just take this situation and equate it into your life. You know what I'm saying? You as a postal employee, man, I know you this might be the most, you know, the most you, you know, the best job you ever had or what or whatnot, maybe not. The most money you ever made, you know, you're trying to do stuff, you got stuff you're trying to get off the ground. So, you know, you gotta, sometimes you, certain people, you gotta leave them in the past. Like, certain people I left in the past, man. <laughs> I used to hang around some crazy cats back in the day. Wild cats, I can't, hey, I can't do it, you know. I got a family. You got a family, you definitely shouldn't be on every scene, man. I'm not on every scene, never, never, never. I used to, I used to be out there when I was younger like that, but nah. Nah, man, I got better stuff. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go kick it, kick it, uh, <laughs> kick it in Jamaica, uh, I, somewhere. Kick it, kick it in Cali, kick it in New York, somewhere. Atlanta, kick it somewhere, but out the country, you know. I got better stuff to do than hang around a, cl a little club, the young goons. You know what I'm saying? There's other stuff you could be doing, man. Especially the Migos. That was like, that's below them to me. These are hundred million dollar guys, all as a collector. So, yeah, man, that uh, it's an unfortunate situation. But I just dropped this video so you can uh, take this as a learning lesson for you and your life. You know what I'm saying? As you elevate, you know what I'm saying. Take this as a learning lesson. Mailman, fresh checking out. You know, logging out. Like, comment, subscribe. Go follow my Instagram at Mailman Fresh or Fresh the Mailman.